Knowledge Master UK Limited advise that drivers should not attempt to program the device whilst their vehicle is in motion and accept no liability for any eventuality which may arise should this advice be contravened. Please note, maps and navigation application and tracking and guidance modes are always displayed showing driving direction. Maps in A to Z application are always displayed north up show GPS position to destination straight cotton line but do not show details on the map of the planned navigation application route. Your cabbie's mate comes to you sealed. You will seal a seal on, on the back of the unit. Before you break the seal you can test the unit through the cellophane wrap by starting it using the instructions already on the site. When you've satisfied that you want to retain the unit then you can break the seal and take the unit from its bag. Any unit which has had the seal broken is non-returnable unless, unless it is actually defective in operation. Okay. Included with the unit in the bottom is a stylus which you can withdraw and use to tap the screen or, should you need to do so, to press the reset button. When you've finished using the stylus, insert it back into the unit for safekeeping. Let me explain the unit sockets. On the side of the unit, this socket is to connect your headphones which are supplied with the unit. This socket here holds the SD card. This socket here doubles up as both the charging socket and also as a USB connection to enable you to download updates from the internet. At the back of the unit there is a small hole which is the reset button. Use the stylus to press that button in should for any reason the unit freeze. That will reset the unit for you. The, the small thing above is in fact a light sensor which alters the picture intensity. To open the A to Z side of the application Tap the A to Z icon. Let's examine the function of the buttons. Tap plus to zoom in. Tap minus to zoom out. Tap nav to toggle to the navigation application. Tap A to Z to return to A to Z. Tap the menu button gives a drop down list of facilities within the unit. Let's put in a destination. You will see the unit has drawn a cotton line from point A to point B indicated by the blue flag showing the destination. To clear that route, tap the clear route button and it disappears from the screen. Tap menu again and you'll see a trace on facility. Tap the trace on and you'll see a, a line is drawn along the route which you're driving. This is a special feature within this unit because if uh, a customer takes you into an estate where you're unaware of the, the roads uh, in the middle of the night and you're not sure where you are, to find your way out to a main road, tap trace on and you can then retrace your steps to get back to the main road which you recognize. To clear that, tap menu, clear trace. Tap the menu button Go to night mode which darkens the screen down. Tap the menu button. A to B on is another new facility within this unit. If you tap the green flag and put in a destination that becomes your start point. If you tap the blue flag clear that destination from the screen and insert another destination that becomes your destination point. The unit has now drawn a blue cotton line between points A and B and you can scroll the screen to get your direct line between those two points to plan your route. The center button, if you tap that with a destination selected you will see three options GPS, Start and Destination. Tap GPS to return to your exact location Tap start to take you back to the beginning of the route that you planned. 
and tap destination to take you to the destination point which was selected. To clear that, you can either do another search or tap menu, clear route. The hide button removes all the other buttons from the screen except for the show button in the bottom left hand corner. You can now scroll the screen without having any other button interfere with the scrolling process. To show the icons again, tap the show button and the other buttons appear back on the screen. Use the map icon to choose between the map which is currently showing, which is the Greater London, extended Greater London map, the UK Street Atlas, the Inner London map, or the Greater London Street Atlas. Tap in, C, T. Now you'll see that the screen is predicting it's gone up to Victor already without my pressing all these letters. Type I and it's opened up Victoria. I need to put in a space and it's gone to the next letter. If I tap R, it offers me retail part with three other letter choices. I tap O and it's now gone to Victoria Road in Bromley. But I know the Victoria Road I want is in West London. There is, however, a drop-down list of Victoria Roads which I can scroll down, but to save time, if I go back and put in Victoria Road and look at, for the Victoria Road in West London, tap W, it gives me options of West London Victoria Roads. If I go back to N, it gives me options of Victoria Roads in North London. And... I can then select from the postcode which Victoria Road I particularly want. Let's say it's Red Hill. If I tap Red Hill, it opens up the map and shows Victoria Red Hill and draws the cotton line from my present position to the chosen destination. I can now center the GPS position from where, to show where I exactly am, center the destination or center the start point from where I selected the route. If you tap postcode, you then have a screen which gives you the letters available to tap for a postcode within the Greater London area. It is predictive, so if you tap W, it then takes out any other letter which uh, is not available to you. If you tap WD and then 2-3, you'll see the cursor has gone across to the next figure, which will be 1 and AA. Tap that and it takes you to, direct to the postcode, which becomes your destination. To clear that, tap menu, clear route. Customer gets into your cab and asks to be taken to the Ritz Hotel. Tap search, tap POI and type in RITZ for Ritz. You'll see the Ritz Hotel is second in the drop-down list. If you tap it, it draws a cotton line to that destination. Automatically, in the background, the navigation side of the unit is calculating a route for you from your, your uh, GPS position to the Ritz Hotel. And you can access that by tapping the navigation icon. To start navigation uh, guidance to that point, tap Start Navigation. Thank you for watching.